city of Brownwood is getting ready to embark on a new journey of city tradition. The first ever Feels Like Home Festival coming up Saturday. Sort of debut for the city's new event center. That's right. The center it has been in the works now for decades to bring community and economic growth with exactly this kind of event. And Kate has Noah McKinney speaking with organizers and a couple of residents to get a feel for the anticipation now just three days out. Not since 2016, with the final Brownwood reunion, has an event of such scale come to this heartland capital city. So you'll excuse the residents if they start the party a little early. Our little grandson, he's a social butterfly. I'll tell you, if he goes, he's not going to meet a stranger. Longtime Brownwood resident Sissy Keith and her grandson Jax getting on stage at the city's new event center in eager anticipation of the first ever Feels Like Home Festival. We just live right around the corner. We've watched this built from the time that they started it till now. So it's very exciting to see and exciting to hear that something's good coming back to Brownwood. The new Brownwood event center, the centerpiece of a new age in Brownwood entertainment. What can the facilities be like for a town of 20,000? You come out here and you're just like, where am I? This is, I was in awe. Since that first glance at the grounds, festival producer Steve Clayton has been working with city staff to bring this decades-long dream into reality. And this is really the culmination of probably about 30 years worth of work for the city. Mayor Stephen Haynes saying in 2022 at the center's groundbreaking that its purpose would be to bring events just like this one back home. Obviously the feels like home that is the city motto and it was like well wait a sec that that's a great festival name. Residents like Keith hoping that community centric mindset will be the basis for a whole new tradition. Everything's scary when you do it for the first time but if you're passionate about it you want to see growth in your communities you'll jump right in you'll lend a hand and you know together you can make Make it happen. Allowing a whole new generation to feel at home in a city and community that have been loved for so, so long. It's going to be an awesome experience for everybody to know that he's going to grow up here and he's going to make a life here and do good here. For BigCountryHomePage.com, I'm Noah McKinney. All right, I think that, uh, yeah, he's, he's now the star of the show. He's that yes, youngster. I hope he's performing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that was a performance, yeah. The inaugural Feels Like Home Festival opens gates on Saturday at 2 p.m. Vendors, food games, multiple musical performances, and they're headlined by the band Midland. Yes. So for more information on the upcoming event, visit the KTAB website, bigcountryhomepage.com. You know, I don't know that that youngster, I don't know how old he was, but I don't know that I've ever seen anybody with those moves that he had. You wow. know, I just don't know. Oh, oh there they are. <laughs> there they are. Except now. <laughs> Those moves. Yeah. And yeah. I pulled a hamstring. Oh, so I'm going to. Okay. We're going to have to do a break now. <laughs> and I got to catch a breather.